Hi, I'm Susanna Steele. I want to wish all the moms out there a happy Mother's Day. My story to motherhood is a little unusual. Um, I always looked forward to being a mom and God planted a seed for foster care in my heart uh, when I was young, even though I really had no connection to that world until I was in college. When I was in college, I met Micah and Blake Melnick um, and got to know foster care through Micah's family, which then blossomed into um, what's now Big House Foundation. And I always knew I wanted to be part of that work. And in 2010, I was able to move to Opelika and become the program director at Big House. Um, at the same time, God was planting a seed in Ben's heart for foster care. And we actually met at Big House um, in 2012 and started dating then and talked about what we wanted our family to look like. Um, and we knew that we wanted foster care and adoption and biological children to all be part of that. Um, we got married in December of 2012 and then um, we started the foster care process about nine months later. We became licensed in 2014 and welcomed our first child home at Christmas that year. And within the next four years, we <laughs> had five children total um, come into our family forever through adoption um, and birth. So we had a very busy four years. There have been so many women in my life that have influenced me as a mom, um, my mom and my grandparents. Um, and I just want to continue that legacy, um, not only for my own children, but also through our church and our community. I've had opportunities to um, be an influencer to other women um, through relationships at Big House um, and also through small groups with Cornerstone. Um, I was fortunate to have um, a family brought into our life through small groups, the first small group that we led um, a couple years ago and they were just starting their foster care journey and we've become good friends and um, they live really close to us and that's been a blessing to our family. When you live out in Salem there's not a lot of neighbors <laughs> so it's been helpful to to have somebody close by that we can um, and drop in and encourage each other. Wherever God has you on your path um, on motherhood right now, I know that He can use you as an influence um, to others that are around you, um, your friends, your neighbors, um, your own children. And I just pray that you would press into that and, um, and see how He would have you um, to pour out what He's given you in your life to encourage others. As moms, we know that our kids are always watching us and imitating what we do. And in 1 Corinthians, Paul um, encouraged the church at Corinth to imitate him as he imitated Christ. So if we keep our eyes on Christ and strive to imitate him, our children will learn from our influence.